It's the easiest way to save money on petrol and to prolong the life of your tyres. And I bet you haven't done it for months. Luckily, checking your tyre pressures is easy, quick and free. Underinflated tyres ultimately mean your tyres are unsafe. We don't want to scare you, but it's that simple. Underinflation can also lead to blowouts and damage when the tyre hits a kerb, uneven tyre wear and even poor fuel economy. While overinflated tyres can reduce road grip, wear your tyres out prematurely and make your car feel terrible over bumps. So how do you know the correct tyre pressure for your car? Well, it's actually quite simple. Car makers recommend specific tyre pressures for each vehicle. This pressure figure is designed to strike a perfect balance between safety, handling, comfort, fuel economy and braking performance. These tyre pressures are usually displayed on a label like this, called a tyre placard, which is usually located in the door frame, in the glove box or even in the fuel filler door. It displays the pressures of the different sized tyres that could potentially be fitted to your car and you can cross-check that right here on the side of your tyre. Sometimes a placard will specify different pressures for the front and rear tyres. That's more for cars that are designed to carry heavy loads. You can check your tyre pressure at any petrol station or a tyre store, or you can get yourself a little gauge like this, which stores neatly in your glove box. To check pressures, unscrew the dust cap off the tyre's valve, firmly push the gauge over the valve stem and hold it so you don't hear any air escaping. And that's it. If you do need to add some air, petrol station pumps with digital gauges will pump up your tyres based on a preset pressure figure. So be sure to set that before you start. So how often should you check your tyre pressure? Every time you fill up would be ideal, but try go for at least once a month. Regular checks could also reveal a slow leak from an embedded object, like a nail, which means you can fix a problem before it leaves you stranded. It's good to check pressures before you drive too, as the air inside hasn't had a chance to heat up and expand, which will give you a higher pressure read. We know that people don't check their tyres anywhere near as much as they should, but as they say, take better care of your tyres and your tyres will take better care of you.